All right, Salawam. First off, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasim, Yahweh Shah, Bahasim, Rakakwadas. Okay, I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And it's just sit, Salawam, taught Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay? <clears throat> I want to go on this topic. Uh, basically, where's your zeal? You know, for this truth, okay? Where's your interest, okay? Your zeal is supposed to be towards, you got woke up, okay? You found out that you're an Israelite, okay? Which that's one thing. You found out the true name of the Lord, okay? And, and, and the truth, period, okay? Your mindset should be on actually serving the Lord, man. Okay. Forget the life that we're living right now, you know, because this life that we're living, this ain't life, man. You can't call this living, man. You know. So, basically, you gotta come into this truth as a new man, man. You gotta wipe away all of that stuff that you uh, did before. Okay. You have to constantly renew yourself, man. You know, every day, okay, it's always going to be a fight. You can't let Satan win, man. You know, you can't let Satan get the advantage of you, okay? I looked up the word, the etymology of the word jealousy, okay? Which, the etymology of the word jealousy, when you go down into the definition, okay, it says zeal. Okay, and it says in the biblical sense, not tolerating any unfaithfulness, man. Okay, so if you have a zeal, okay, for this truth, then that means that you're faithful. Okay, now I'm gonna get this scripture. This is uh, 1 Corinthians 14 and uh. I'm going to start at uh, 12. It says, Even so ye, for as much as you are zealous of spiritual gifts, right? Because you got some uh, people, right? They're coming to this truth and they hold on to the fact that, oh, I'm, I'm a, a good speaker or, hey, the Lord done exalted me up on a level of being a speaker or whatever the case may be, you may think, oh, I got a couple people who uh, watch my videos and stuff like that, okay? And that that encourages people to do more, more and more videos, you know? Because they have a crowd, okay? Now, are you able to, 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 to do them videos even though you don't have a crowd, okay? Because this ain't about uh, trying to have a crowd, man. You know, it's about getting getting that word out, man. You know? I don't care if no if my videos, which some of them do be having no views on that, man. You know? The scriptures say, preach the word unto the wind, man. Okay? If the Lord want, want you to have multiple videos or multiple views on your videos, then that's what's going to happen, man. Okay? People think that the apostles, you know, they just came out and then all of a sudden they just um, got as many views as they are getting now, man. You know? You got to start from somewhere, man. Okay? And and, and when, if you if you humble yourself down, okay, the Lord will exalt you. And then, you know, if you're doing what the Lord say, the Lord will bring up the, the, the views, man. You know, if that's what you want, but we shouldn't be in this thing for the views, man. Okay? Or the fact that we have, you know, certain spiritual gifts and stuff like that. You know, but that's a good thing. But who gave up the, the, it's called a gift for a reason, man. You know, somebody gave it to you. How about somebody outside gave us the, this gift, man. Okay, what's the ultimate gift is, is, is faith and prophecy, man. You know. It says, seek that 
you may excel to the edifying of the church, okay? And that's what that's what we supposed to be doing, man. Okay, trying to reach the 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 the, the brothers, okay? The ones that 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 aren't yet brothers that that's coming in, okay? In the videos that we do, okay, you may go through a lesson and the next thing you know, a brother may come up, okay, and he might ask you a question. Okay, and this might be a sincere brother, man. But you just did a video on that. You could probably lead that brother onto the video that you just did, man. You know? This truth works in different avenues, man. You know? But you have to you have to, to, to practice. That's one of the things with the videos, practicing, you know. But then also coming coming together with the brothers, man. That's really important, man. You know? Um, let me get uh Second Corinthians. The uh seventh chapter. And uh eleventh uh, uh verse. Okay. Second Corinthians. 7 and uh, 11 it says for for behold this same self same thing that you are sorrowed after a godly sort what carefulness of yourself I mean what it's like it it says what carefulness it wrought in you yeah okay so in this truth you're supposed to be uh, careful and walking on eggshells man you know but guess what some guys they come in and they think Oh, it's too 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 much man like you know i gotta walk i gotta be too much too careful you know when i'm around brothers i gotta be too careful see i did a video you know if you just be yourself man you'll fit right on in man you know you don't have to be sitting up there thinking oh i gotta be too careful you know just be yourself man but you also need to know who you representing man okay when you when you are uh being careful man because if you're not careful, then the Lord going to destroy you, man. That goes into to having fear, man. Okay, it says, um, what clearing of yourselves, yeah, okay? Because, hey, you got, you got some people, you know, they can't take a rebuke. And uh, they want to try to clear their name and stuff like that. Guys who always feel as though that they right. Never self-examining, uh, examining themselves, you know. You gotta understand what, what, what is, what is the real clearing of yourself, man? Okay, it ain't the fact that you, that you, you know, you always right, man. You know, it's the fact that y'all, y'all y'all side, okay, made us a new, new creature, man. And it's truth, man. Okay, see, in this world, you may have all type of felonies and. You know, di all, all different types of health, you know, and, and, and uh, your credit might be fucked up. And Esau ain't, 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 ain't thinking about clearing you, man. You know? But how about some y'all side clear you, man? Okay? It says, yeah, what, what indignation? Indignation, righteous, righteous anger, man. You know, the fact that y'all by some y'all side is going to destroy America, man. Okay, that should interest you, man. Okay, that should interest you. Okay, it says, yeah, what fear? Okay, these things should be in your mind, man. When you, when you're, if you're zealous, okay, towards the Lord, and you're not lacking uh, faithful. This, okay, these things to be in your mind. It says, What, yeah, what vehement desire? Okay, what should you be desiring, man? Okay, that's this truth, man. That's what the, that's what your zeal is supposed to be for, man. Okay, it says, Yeah, what zeal, yeah, what revenge, and all things you are approved yourselves to be clear in this matter you know so if you zealous man you're gonna you're gonna be thinking about okay you desire this truth okay you you know that this is the, the the perfect way to be you know a man okay 
This is this wisdom is above all things. Okay. That Yahweh by Shem Yahshai, if you do what he say, that he's going, man. The promises that the Lord going to give onto his service for actually doing his work, you know, for actually having a, a very, very strong interest into this work coming together for 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 the, for the brothers, you know. The, the 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 things that the Lord have planned for them for them for them men, man, you know, it's so far beyond imagination. So it's like the the, the to have a, an interest in that man compared to the to 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 this world, right? Where if you have an interest in something, you know. You, you, you got to go to work, you know, you got to pay bills, you, 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 you know, you catching hell, you know, you probably got children, probably got, you know, child support or whatever, paying bills and, you know, you might, you might want to get a pair of shoes, you can't even get the shoes that you want, man, you know, but then guess what, them shoes that you want, you know, it don't, it don't really be worth it at the end of the day, man. Because what? If you scuff the shit, then what, man? You can't really trade that shit in. You know, you're going to have to go get the shit repaired. But guess what, man? What's coming, man? What's coming down, you know, the pipe for, for, for the elect, you know? We're going to be super rich, man. We ain't going to have to worry about no shoes and stuff, man. We're going to have servants and stuff, man. You know? You want to be a part of the first fruits. Okay, of the kingdom. You don't want to die and come come back and hopefully, you know, you you uh, <laughs> you know, you don't know what you don't want to be the least in the kingdom, you know. I mean, given the fact that the least in the kingdom, you know, is going to be you know better than you know any other nation, you know. But you don't want to just ride off the the, the coattail. Of, oh yeah, I'm just an Israelite, so I know I'm going to make it, you know, in the kingdom one way or another. No, our mindset should be, hey, the Lord woke me up, and if you and if you uh, do have that mentality, you know, the Lord will put you to death, man. You know, more horrible than than He will uh, the ones that don't know, because you know this truth, man. Okay, so the fact that you know this truth should so, so, so put a flame up on your ass, man. Okay. You know this truth and you know what's required of you, man. Okay? And that's to teach this word. Okay? To, to, to be a brother. Okay? And stop being a nigga. You know, these people who don't know the truth, you know, they can use that excuse to say, I don't know the truth, man. You know? But the, the, the ones that do, you won't get beaten with many stripes, man. You know? Because you know. You fucking know, man. It ain't, where's your zeal at, man? Ain't no reason, man. You know? The scriptures in, uh, in, uh, Romans, I believe, you know, talk about Israel, you know, the ones that don't know, man, they have a, 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 a zeal towards Yahweh by Shemyosh. Not Yahweh by Shemyosh, but they have a zeal towards God, man. But not according to knowledge, man. But you know, man. So where's your zeal at? Where's your interest at, man? I'm gonna get, uh... I'm gonna get this. Uh, Galatians. The fourth verse. Okay. I mean, the fourth, fourth uh, chapter the eighth verse. It says, How be it then, when you knew not Yahweh Shem Yahshah, you did service unto them which by nature are no gods. You know? When you was in the world, you know, whatever it, it, it could have been, man, you know, whether it was white Jesus, okay? Whether it was money, whether it was women, You was you was you was worshiping that shit, man. And you had no problem with it. You loved it. You enjoyed it. You know? 
But when it when it comes down to how about some y'all side calling you into this truth? You ain't showing that you love them? You ain't showing that you appreciate this truth? I, I don't think guys, you know, really appreciate this truth, man. You know? I don't think they do, man. They 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 probably feel as though, hey man, I I I I could have been the next uh football player, you know? Could have been the next uh fucking rap star or some shit. And and and, and, and still, you know, miss the world, man. Rather than, than, than this world of the truth, man, that, that, that we in, man, you know? Or, 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 you know, the scriptures, you know, say, you know, uh, sweet like honey, but then it gets bitter, man, you know? This is uh, Revelation 3 and uh, 19. It says, as many as I love, I rebuke and chasten, Okay? You got to look at it, man, like, okay, you catch a hell, that's the Lord chast chastising you, man. Okay, like a son, man, you got to deal with it. You got to know that, hey, we know where all this this, this temptation and and uh, everything comes from, man. It comes from, you know, it, the Lord, okay, this, what the scriptures say, okay, no man, you know, the Lord tempts no man, okay, the, you know, he uses Satan, okay? But even still in the middle of all that temptation that y'all by some y'all side makes a way for you to get up out of that stuff, man. You know, he ain't going to suffer you to be tempted above that which you are able, okay? So so you you facing temptation or you, you going through hell, okay? That's just the Lord chastising you, Okay? Is a, is a son in dealing with you, man. Okay, because he loves you, man. And and, and guys can't handle that uh that that uh hell, man. When it when it comes down on them, man. You know. You gotta look like oh shoot, you know I lost this, I lost that, my woman gone, you know. Hey, who gave it to me? The Lord gave it to me. Okay. I end up homeless. I end up, you know, whatever, man. Lose your job, your car, your woman, you know, somebody die. You got to look at it like, man, that's how about some y'all side, man. And and I just hope that at the end of the day, you know, he, he continues to have mercy on me, man. Okay? And you got, what, pray? Fast? That's, that's a part of the zeal also, man. Be a brother. The scriptures say charity covers a multitude of sins. You're not covering a multitude of sins if you're sitting down in the house, okay, on your ass with your woman and, and, and children, you know, all in the house. No, that's not that's not charity. Charity is when you're coming up with the brothers, man, linking up with the brothers, man. Okay? Brother may be going through something, man, and the brother may be there for you, man, through the spirit, man. Or you be there for the brother. Okay, it's uh, Revelation 3 and 19. It says, as many as I love, I rebuke and chasten. Like I said, a lot of people can't take that chastisement, man, or that rebuke, man. Okay, and that, 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 that destroys their interest, man, because they looking for something else, man. You know, something totally different. You know, your interest is supposed to be in what your how about some side wants, man. Not what you want, man. You know, see these fucking people out here in the streets, man, don't know how to fucking drive, man. You know, they interested in, in, in uh, you know, who knows what's, what's going through the mind of these people out here, man. You know, you know, they're trying to try to beat traffic and, you know, just to, 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 to go get a weed sale or some shit, man. You know, to be a fucking nigga, man. Is that what your, your zeal is? To be a nigga in this world? You know, to be to be destroyed? Because if you if you on that path, 
You know, you're not following what the scripture say and do. You're going to get destroyed, man. Like I said, man, the scriptures say, you know, the ones that know you're going to get beaten with, with multiple stripes, man. Because you know better. You know what you're supposed to be doing. You know? And it's not hard, man, because we know where everything comes from. Let me get uh, uh, 2 Corinthians, the 8th chapter. 2 Corinthians 8 and uh, 12. It says, For if there be first a willing mind, it is accepted according to that a man has. Okay, and that willing mind goes into zealous, man. Okay, a person that is interested in this truth and doing what the scriptures say, man. Okay, and we accept brothers for what they have, man, and not what they don't have, man. Okay, the fact that you actually, you know, want to do the work, the fact that you actually, you know, the brother in, in uh, my camp, you know, uh, the head of the Baltimore camp, uh, Karat is about he did a video. Hey, the fact that a man wants to be in the game, you know, he, that he actually wants to win, you know, you don't be like, yo, I'm going to put that guy out there because he actually wants to win, man. Rather than a guy that, you know, just sitting back, he got all the talent in the world and shit, you know. He got all the talent in the world, but he don't want to win. His interest in it is in totally different other, other things except for winning for y'all by some y'all side. Okay? That's what that's what we what we are interested in, man. You know? The fact that 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 a person has a willing uh mind, man. Okay? A zealous spirit, man. Okay? It says, uh, and not according to that, he has not, you know, so this truth ain't about, uh, you know, brother, you ain't, you know, you ain't got all the money, you know, you, you, you ain't able to, uh, you know, you catch a house or you ain't, you ain't able to, to, to do this, that or whatever, you know, this ain't that ain't what this truth is about, man. If you got it, then we expect it, man. That's expected of you to do those things, man. You know, if you got the talent to, to, to speak, it's expected of you to speak, man. Okay? But if you don't got the time to speak, that how can we sit up there and, and, and make you speak? We can't make make a lukewarm person speak, man. You know? You you shouldn't even feel comfortable speaking, man, if you lukewarm, man. You know? Uh uh uh, uh we expect brothers to just keep it real with themselves, man, and just be like, hey man, I, you know, pray for me, you know. I, 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 some people, you know, hey, scoffers, when they leave out there, admit that they got demons on them, man. But then you got guys that that's, that claim to be in the truth, you know, that, that can't even admit that they got demons on them, man. You know? There's always something else with, with everything else, man. You know? They, they, they try to find uh, problems in every, every other uh, category except for the category of themselves, man. You know? So it's like, where is it? Where is this hill at, man? You know, this is James five and uh, thirteen. It says, "Is is any among you afflicted? Let him pray." So if you if you catching hell, man, you know you getting rebuked and stuff like that. You feel afflicted in the in the spirit. You're supposed to pray, man. You know, because you gotta be like, where is it all coming from? It's coming from y'all by some y'all side. You know, see, see, guys. Be, be so, you know, distraught when they, you know, getting rebuked, which rightfully so, you are getting rebuked for, for, for a reason, man. It, it don't matter what the, what the heck the reason is, man. You know? You're supposed to be looking like, oh, yeah, maybe, I, maybe I am, you know? Even if you feel as though that you, you, you're doing right. Maybe I, maybe I am doing something wrong. You know? Just for the sake of, you know, the, the, the brother is telling me. You know, maybe I am doing something. Hey, I got to I got to check myself. You know, you supposed to hey, take the take that, man. Now, you got some situations where like I said, 
the, the guy may be, you know, he, he trying to find something in every other category except for, except for himself, you know, so he going to sit up there and be like, yo, this brother ain't right. You know, that brother ain't right. Even if that, that a guy did say something like that, right? And let's say he ended up being a scoffer or whatever. You know, you may be like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, he, he is going off. He, you know, because, you know, what the scriptures say? Uh, well, the, there's a saying that a broken clock is right two times a day, you know? So you can look at the fact that somebody said something about you, okay, even though they may be broken, and just be like, okay, well, he did say, say two things, right? You know about me and they maybe hey, I gotta I gotta find the spirit even though this guy is a demon, okay? And what he's saying and 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 uh and make myself better, man. Okay, maybe I can do something more wise in order to make sure that I don't get rebuked no more, man. I mean uh not rebuke, you know, but but make sure I don't end up in that situation that that person is talking about, man. You know, and that's why brothers are dead, man. His brother's been through it. The scriptures go, the scriptures touch on everything, man. So if you're afflicted on any any uh, occasion, man, you're supposed to just look at it from off a spiritual aspect and pray, man. Okay? It says, as any merry, let him sing songs. You know? If you, if you, if you, you know, the Lord is blessing you and stuff like that, you're supposed to be praising y'all by some y'all side, man. You know? You be trying to take the glory from y'all by some y'all side, man. Cause the Lord will destroy you, man. You know? You're zealous or being zealous or faithful is supposed to be towards y'all by some y'all side, man. You know? Whether you catching hell or whether you you, you uh, not catching hell, man. The Lord blessing you or something, man. You know? This is uh the, the book of Luke. And I'm going to end it on this one. The book of uh, Luke uh, 12. And I'm going to start at uh, 42. Okay, uh, Luke 12 and uh, 42. It says, And the Lord said, Who then is that faithful and wise steward whom his Lord shall make ruler over his household? Okay, if you, you know, you got some guys that want to be, you know, uh, in a position of uh, leadership, don't know, don't know how, tough those, those uh, things are as far as uh, being a leader, you know? This ain't being no uh, lords over over the men's flock, man, you know? Being a leader, okay, and this truth is, is you know, it, it, it requires a lot of a lot of things, man, a lot of patience, okay, a lot of self-control, okay? The scriptures say about, you know, being a bishop, you know? Those things require a lot you know, and not the, 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 the ways of this world, man, okay, being drunk off the philosophies of this world, okay, so it says, who, who then is that, that, that faithful and wise steward whom the Lord shall make ruler of over his household, right, so who is that, who is that man, okay, that, you know, that is zealous, man, that the Lord is going to put over, over the, 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 the flock, man, you know, it says to give them their portion of meat in due season. So that man that is a a, a, a leader, okay, he's supposed to be leading by example. Okay? He's supposed to be, you know, feeding the flock. Okay? He's supposed to be in the spirit. He's supposed to be zealous, extremely faithful, man. Okay, having an extreme interest. And this truth, man, you don't have an extreme interest in this truth. You don't deserve to be in this truth, man. Okay, and sometimes the Lord called niggas into this truth because the scriptures say many are called, but few are chosen, man. The Lord will call a nigga into this truth just to show him, as, make him an example, man, you know, of what not to be, man, okay? And you don't want to be that guy of what not to be, man, okay? It says, uh, blessed is that servant it says blessed is that servant whom his lord when he cometh 
so far so doing okay what what is that man okay that ain't just the fact of you know being a Saturday Israelite you know coming you know doing doing your, your videos and you know you want to just do videos just you know just because man you know your your, your interest is into y'all but some outside man you know not just doing the bare minimum and you know just trying to get away no man you know the, the 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 linking up with brothers man communicating with brothers man being a brother man that's what the lord wants man okay somebody that's interested in him man okay you get you get like like a lot of a lot of guys want these banging ass women and stuff like that right the women ain't even fucking interested in you for real you know women make feel like you a fucking clown man but what is she interested in your, your money you know or, or the things that you can do for her you know or the status that you may have okay women flock to power man and guys with the power in this society, especially right now, what Esau gives them, man. Instead of what y'all but some y'all side give them, man. You know? They'll, they'll just stop at Isaiah 4 and 1 instead of reading all the way down, man. You know? Oh, yeah, Isaiah, Isaiah 4 and 1, my favorite scripture. Yeah, yeah, that's your favorite scripture. But, but you don't know what that entails, man. Okay? The scriptures say that the Lord is going to make a, a man uh, more precious than, than, than gold, man. You know, the Lord is going to do that, man. Not yourself, man. It says, uh, Of a truth, I say unto you, that he will make him ruler over all that he has. The Lord ain't going to put a nigga who ain't interested in, you know, what the Lord has, man. Over, over, uh, in rulers in a in a ruling place, man. Why would the Lord put you in a in a place of 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 you know ruling the way He has, and you ain't even interested in what your house on your side has, man. You know, or, or has given you, man, or is giving you, man, through the Spirit, man. It says, but and if that servant say in his heart, my Lord delays his coming, and so begin to 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 beat. The men servants and maidens <coughs> and to eat and drink and to be drunken okay the Lord of that servant so come in a day when he looks not for him because you ain't looking at, at the prophecies of you know being a watchman and stuff like that man you know you sitting up there steady worried about what other brothers ain't doing or you know you being drunk and off the philosophies of this world. So what the scripture said, the Lord going to come on a day when you ain't looking, man. He's going to take you out, man. It says, um, when, when he, when he looking not for him, right? And at an hour when he is not aware and will cut him in sunder and will appoint him his portion with the unbelievers okay so where is your zeal at man okay if your zeal if you on fire for y'all by some y'all side okay you're gonna be linking up with brothers you're gonna be calling brothers you're gonna be into the video studying okay you're gonna be you know uh you're gonna be really about this word man because you're gonna be really interested okay and the and the ups and downs of this truth man you know Till death do you part, man. You're gonna really be into this thing, man. The Lord, the Lord, he rebuked you, and guess what? You 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 sitting up there, hey, well, what the scriptures say? You ain't you ain't just gonna bitch up at the, the smallest uh sense of hell coming at you, man. Everything and all things, man, when it when it comes down to being careful in this truth, having a desire for this truth, man. Okay, your zeal and your interest to both being what this Bible says, man. Okay, and worshiping and serving y'all by some y'all sign the spirit, man. You know, but that's 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 my my thing, man. Brothers don't appreciate this truth, man. You know, they don't they don't uh 
they don't love you how about some y'all side you know I, you know all the monotonous i just did a video on that man you know where's your love with that man hopefully this was edifying man you know i want to say uh solid warm till next time